Hey everyone, it's Ashley. Welcome back. Today I'm going to be trying out some new products from the collab with Neutrogena and Kerry Washington. So I will be trying out the Essential Cheek Palette and the Essential Eye Palette, kind of getting an all over face look. So first things first, I'm going to start with the Essential Cheek Palette. It has three products in it, a bronze, blush, and highlight. So let's just get started. So to apply my bronzer, I'm going to use my Real Techniques buffing brush and see how this works out. Okay, so I went in a little too hard. Whoops. This doesn't come in other shades. It just is this one palette, so it's supposed to be versatile for all skin tones. But I kind of see that there might be a problem with it. I'm too fair and it's a little too dark for me. I think for warmer skin tones, it won't be dark enough. Maybe you can keep building it. We'll just have to wait and see what the reviews say about it. Next, I'm going to go into the blush with my Morphe Deluxe Angled Brush. Ooh, a lot of fallout. Oh man, okay, so far these colors are a little too dark for me. Maybe I'm going in too hard. I am tapping off the excess, but it's just too, too dark for me. So let's just blend the crap out of this. Shade is really pretty, but I just feel like it's a little too dark for me. Okay, last in the palette, we're gonna take that highlighter shade and I'm gonna use my Morphe M510. So it's funny, the blush and the bronzer are really pigmented and the highlighter is not. It's really chalky and I've layered it three times right now and I'm getting a little bit of a highlight. I guess this, this is supposed to be like a natural palette. But man, oh man, I was expecting a bigger payoff based on the other products in this palette. All right, so this is not for me. It could be better for other skin tones, but it just it just didn't work for my complexion. All the shades were really creamy, which was nice, but you know, just not for me. Okay, so next I'm gonna try the Essential Eye Palette. This comes in five shades, and it says it has up to 12 hours of rich nourishing color and built-in primer to help prevent creasing and smudging. And it's also safe for sensitive eyes, which is great because I wear contacts and my allergies are just killing me right now. So I'm gonna use my Ipsy L34 Blind Beauty and use the shade Confident. It is the lightest brownish shade. I'm gonna use it as my transition shade and hopefully it's not too dark. Oh, that's quite nice. Now using my M441, I'm gonna go into the shade Flirty and put it in my crease. So far these are blending really nice and they're really creamy. I'm not really having any fallout in the pan. Thank God, it's such a relief. Now I'm gonna use my Morphe M433 and go into the shade Focused and just pack it on the outer corner of my eye. I'm gonna use a clean fluff brush and just blend the harsh lines. Using the same color focus and my Morphe M431, I am just going to buff a little bit under my eye. Using my Sonia Kashuk number 106, I'm gonna go into the lightest shade Brilliant and put it on my eyelid. So I don't wanna mute this smoky eye with a black eyeliner. So I'm going to make one from this palette. I'm gonna use my Morphe Flat Concealer Brush, spritz it with some Smashbox Primer Water and go into the deepest shade Powerful and just make a little bit of eyeliner with it. Okay, and business as usual, I'm gonna put on some mascara and I will be right back. All right, I am back. So to give an overview of these products, the Essential Cheek Palette, as I said before, is a pass for me. The Essential Eye Palette, I definitely like. This is $12.99, and you know, there isn't any crazy colors in it, but it is an Essential Eye Palette, so you're getting your essential sort of light, smoky eye, not a crazy dark eye, which, I mean, you could build up if you wanted to, but the colors were really nice and creamy. They went down nice. There was no splotchiness. I didn't have to do anything crazy to build it up. So this is a really nice little palette. All right, that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Now go have yourself an awesome day.